Hey everyone, this is Sanjog, second year MBBS student at Sikkim Manipal Institute of Medical Sciences. In this video, I am going to take you through my last few days of preparation for the second prof university exam, which is from 2nd of March 2024. After the pre university exams, we had got a one month long study break. At first, I thought that one month will be more than enough to cover all the syllabus including the backlogs. But the days passed on so quickly, just like a bullet train, until I realized that I had only 7 days left for my university exams. So now I have 7 days in my hand and also a huge chunk of syllabus staring at me still waiting to be covered. Normally I stay awake till 1 or 2 at night. And now it's almost 2 a.m. so it's time for me to go to bed. Tomorrow I'm going to get up early in the morning and restart with a fresh and a new energy. Please like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'm going to keep on, sir. I'm going to keep on, sir. I'm going to keep on, sir. After having breakfast with Kunjang, now I'm back in my room again. So today I'll be studying pathology for the whole day. Okay, here I am giving a glance to the topics that are really important. This will help me to focus more on the topics that were frequently asked in the previous years. And also this will save my time as I'll not be reading the not so important things. After continuously studying for 3 hours straight, I again went to mess to have lunch with my friends. I don't wanna make this comment, but the mess food is not so tasty most of the times. Staying in our hostel is fun and exciting apart from the mess food. Okay, it's almost 1pm now. And I have a lot of more chapters, a lot more chapters, you know, a lot more chapters to cover. Uh, like huge chapters like um, uh, renal, CVS, um, respiratory and other minor chapters like uh, skin, bones and all. So I think now I have to speed up because in this space, I think uh, if I continue with this space then it won't be possible to cover all the paper 2 subjects, uh, paper 2 uh, topics. So yeah, I'm going to speed up now.
just three days left for our exams. Yeah, now it's only three days, hardly three days left to go to give the biggest exam of the year and our heartbeats are already racing. And today I'll be studying pharma for a whole day. The one subject that I would like to remember from second year. I don't want to say that I want to forget the other two subjects completely. But this thing right here is interesting and special. So here I am using a review of pharmacology by Govind Raigarh to solve uh, some MCQs. Though I couldn't solve all the MCQs due to lack of time, I think I should have started solving MCQs by the start of second year. So since uh, from this year we are having 20 MCQs in our university exams, so it's better to solve MCQs and uh, get good score one thing the most valuable thing that i learned in these two years in mbbs is never give up during the exams especially during the university exams things do get ugly not just because of the huge syllabus but it's also difficult to keep all those things in your mind Today you read something and the next day you hardly remember anything about it. Tomorrow you might have your university or any other exams and tonight if you choose to give up then you are gone. Whatever you are doing, wherever you are, I just want to say one thing and that is never give up. Never, never give up. Just get out of your bed, find some previous year questions. If you don't have then you can ask your friends or seniors and see what's important and what's frequently asked in previous years and go through all those topics and if you can't understand any one topic then please don't waste your time on it rather you can just mock it up yes you heard right you can just mock it up and write it in your exam tomorrow because you need to pass it anyhow by this i'm not saying that you just have to study for the sake of passing in the exams you can always come back learn about the topic and get the concepts more clearly because learning is a lifelong process and it's never too late to learn about something and yeah revise as much as you can solve as many mcqs as you can and whoever you are wherever you come from it doesn't define what you can do, what you can achieve and what you can be. It all depends upon your hard work and determination. So, never give up. Alright, uh, we it's uh, 1 a.m. Uh, 1 a.m. 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 Yeah, it's 1 11 a.m. and we are still studying. Uh, today is 1st of March. Today is 1st of March. And we are going to exam. And we are going to study the paper. We have uh, Pharma paper 1. Probably not so young. And we are going to study the paper. दो तीन दो तीन बजे तक पढ़ना पड़ेगा। Still there's a lot more to cover। तो वही है। So please like, share, subscribe। Please like, share and subscribe Kunzak's channel as well। Please subscribe Kunzak's channel as well। Kunzang Ethenpa। I'll put the या Kunzang Dorji। I'll put the I'll put his channel's link in in the description box। यह क्वेश्चन अभी अभी वो पढ़ के थोड़ा सा रेस्ट कर रहा है जैसे जैसे ही आँख खुलेगा जैसे ही आँख खुलेगा पास जब बुक देखेगा बुक देखेगा और है सो दिस इज इट सेवरल डेज लेटर कल कल हमारा लास्ट एग्जाम है टुमारो वी आप और लास्ट एग्जाम डेट इस पैथोलॉजी पेपर टू यूनिवर्सिटी एग्जाम एंड अभी यहाँ पे एकदम गर्म टेंशन का माहौल छाया हुआ है 
यहाँ तरफ सब लोग पढ़ रहे हैं यहाँ पे मोपनी मे भी यहाँ पे मतलब हिंदी बोलता है यहाँ पे दौड़ दौड़ के पढ़ रहा हूँ ऐसे तैसे हमने बाकी पांच एग्जाम तो दे दिया बहुत मे, बहुत मेहनत करके लेकिन ये लास्ट तो एकदम काफ़ी मुश्किल है क्या लेकिन क्या करें देना ही पड़ेगा हमें आँख भी कैसा कैसा हो गया है पढ़ पढ़ के बस तीन घंटा तीन ही घंटा सो रहे हैं हम लोग एवरी नाइट तीन घंटा सो के सो के जाके एग्ज़ाम दे रहे हैं कोई तो कोई 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 तो यहाँ पे सो सो भी नहीं रहा है ऐसा देख आँख देख सकते हैं आप कितना काला हो चुका है इसका आँख